back to another video. In this video, we're going to do a live walkthrough of the stock that we have. Um, one of the channels has been a little bit outdated now. Um, since we sold some since uh, last time we did a live video. It's been a little bit. So we're going to go ahead and do a live walkthrough and check out what we have available here. But before we do that, we just got back a little bit ago. We are down in Louis. So let me pronounce this right because we were corrected by, people, by the, the city folk down there. We were corrected. So instead of us saying Louisville, it's Louisville. So you say it all together. We were just down in Louisville for the Triple Crown convention just got over. It was the American Cichlid Association, American Library Association, American Jellyfish Association, and the National Australian uh, Rainbow Association. Um, big convention down in Louisville, let me say that right again, you know, we were correct, like I said. Um, Kentucky there for the uh, for the convention, so we just got back, figured, why not do a live stream, let's walk around, let's see what stock we have available. We have a sale going on, if you haven't followed us online, send our newsletter uh, on Friday, I believe, and uh, we posted some stuff online. So we have select males right now, $42.99 to $59.99 on sale. And we have some females on sale for $19.99. So let's go check them out. All right. So we have this tank, any male in this tank. We have bicolor 500 males. We have uh, some Melanicar, Kobu, Stuart Grantai uh, males. We have some, a couple hybrid males in here. And then we have some uh, right there, really nice uh, a lot of cars through Grant I, uh, Eusicea, Flavessa Peacock, sorry. Slipped my mind for a second. So majority of these are all $42.99 on our site instead of the normal $50. Sale is gonna be good through, as of now, tomorrow night. I'll see how it goes. I might extend it a couple of days, but, uh, but yeah, don't miss your chance to get some of these fish for $42.99, nice color males. Same thing down here with the, the Livingstone Eye. We have our Livingstone Eye males at $42.99 on sale. And females, $19.99 for the uh, Livingstone females. Hey Dave, what's going on? So, you know, if you want to breed some Livingstone, here's your chance to get some, some males for a good price and females as well. Then we also have some uh, Didium Chromus Dragatus. We have a couple males still, and some females. There's one of the males there. There's the dominant guy. And there's the other one back there. So these guys are still available. They're trying to breed. He's being pretty rough on the females right now. So I'm probably gonna have to pull the males out. There's them down to three females. Should be four, I have to check. Uh, Hey, what's going on? So I have to uh, see if I'm missing something. Oh, no. Anyways, let's keep going. So here's another tank of all these fish are $42.99. So let not species red flush males. Also, a lot of Cara Havanchi red shouldered peacocks males. Um, that are on sale right now on the site for $42.99. So Check it out if you're interested in any of those to stock your tank with. My light went out, but we still do have these, uh, some good chromos, uh, Nordetania for sale, but I believe these are females. I need to pull these out and put my handy dandy specs on to vent them. But I believe they're females, so I'll have to, have to check that. But we still have some nice, uh, L201, Stonewall Pleckos available, some green phantoms, some high fin green phantoms, a couple watermelon Pleckos down here, there's one there, those guys are still available. Uh, check them out on our website, so clown loaches are still available, the gold severums we have. So just make sure we check out our website, we don't only just have cichlids now, we have Pleckos and Corys and some other some other good, good fun stuff for your aquarium needs. And then same thing with this tank. Yeah, so I have female sunshine peacock of it available and uh, female Lawandas available. 
That's it for the female peacocks that I have. So the sunshine, sunshines and Luandas. Over in this tank again, $42.99 for, uh, hey, how you doing there, Scuba Steve? So $42.99 on sale. We have more bicolors in here. Have a Luanda there. Have some uh, yellow blaze lithobates. Nice color males and some juvenile males. So again, these are on sale too. We also have our Nagara on sale. So if you're looking for some a lot of cars to regret the Nagara, again, these guys are on sale for uh, $42.99. And same thing with our Kobu. Our Kobu, excuse me. Copper Chromus Maloto, Ivory Hand Maloto. There is a male and a couple of females. Hey, thanks, appreciate it. There is a, some males and a couple of females left. Um, so, if you're interested in these, these are on sale as well. And let's keep walking. All right, yeah, so if you're interested, like I said, the females are $19.99. You can go on my website and go and order them and then uh, figure out how to get them shipped to you, whether you want a UPS or, or cargo. Um, so if you're interested in them. All right, we'll keep walking around. Quarry cats, anybody wants the quarry? So these are uh, quarry doors, Brevinotis, because they're a nice long snout, and some... Uh, Wild orange steam plecos, yes, uh, plecos. So those are on our site as well if you're looking for some plecos and quarry cats. Here's some male Luandas we have available. And some females, so some females are holding probably a good half a dozen. Yeah, it looks like a good half a dozen females are holding in here. Uh, from these guys are already breeding, so. Looks like I'll be pulling out some Luanda fry for a little bit. Also still down here has some uh, Protomelus Steve and I Imperial Blue Golds, males and male and males and females available. Again, these are same on sale, $42.99 for these gorgeous males. And then $19.99 for the girls. So if you want to breed this fish, it's really nice fish to breed. So and then same thing down here, Red Empress. Nice red empress males, $42.99. And then the OB female OB males are on sale as well. I believe for $42.99 or $44.99, I think maybe on the OBs. Is the way I did it uh, for them. So looking for males there. You know, check them out. Try to see what else is over here. Let's go this away. Still have some Restratus females available. Anybody wants to breed some Restratus, Frosty Girls Restratus. These are wild caught females that are still available in here. Over here we have some uh, Lemon Jake males available. Some uh, Portamelis Splotinus Tanzanians. Some Portamelis uh, Tanzanianus Ned Nedweed, the fire haps. The blue fire haps available. Also some Protomelis marginatus males available. Any males male in here again is $42.99 on sale. Want some juvies? Yeah, we got some juvies as well. If you like the predator haps, want them small and grow them out. We got some Aristochromus Christii Malawi Hawks. Some Ramsochromus uh, species for yellow. Also some uh, lovely Phosphochromus Restratus. Sales only going on through, through tomorrow night. I might extend it to Wednesday. I haven't decided yet. But right now it's posted online. It's through, to, through tomorrow night. And then some uh, Protomelis Splotinus Tanzanian juvenile males starting to look really, really nice in this 180. All right, let's uh, keep it going here. Like some black widows, got some black widow frontosas available. These guys are an inch, inch and a half. So if you're interested in those, we have them. Now, uh, where's he at? Got some demasonite. Need some demasonite for your Mabuna tank. I got 
nine or ten uh, the Mason I available. Some uh, Pristogrammos, uh, double red cockatoides. Looking for a, tree, a couple of trios of pistols. I can, I can help you with that. There's one of the males right there for the uh, the pistols. And then over here we have, still have some nice male Dinamochromos kiwingis. These I believe we did put on sale for. Uh, you have to go look, but I know the kiwingi males I did put on sale, maybe fifty two ninety nine on them, um, but I did put those on sale. Some. Some really nice ones there. Nice size, nice color. So don't miss out on those. And then down here we have some really, really nice Fuscos. There's one there. These guys are every eight inch plus Fuscos. So if you're looking for some large Fuscos, we got six available. So go check out our website for those. As well, also these are Protomelis Melodinus Mara Rocks. Those I believe I put on sale as well, so go the Fuscos are not on sale, but I believe the Protomelis species of Mara Rocks are. So go check that out. Still have one of these guys left, the Stigmatic Chromus Philip Philippus. Available, very rare. This is wild caught Stigmatic Chromus male. That's up on the site as well. Have this really really nice tangerine tiger still available every bit of seven inches he's on the site as well he's available have this nice uh ob sunshine still that's available here anybody looking for an ob sunshine then we also still have some of these axochromus anagenes yes we have uh some males left of these guys so these are on the site starting to get some really nice color there's a male for sure. Hey, how you doing, Jim, Zen Ginger? Thanks for uh, tuning in there. So we have these nice exochromos available. Again, if you're looking for males, they are on our site. Um, if you go on the site and they say sold out, send me a message and I can fix that for you. I'm just adding the limited number at a time so I make sure I don't oversell the, the males that I have available. So don't want anybody disappointed, you know, go buy it and then I don't have the fish in stock to send you. So trying to keep my inventory up, updated that way and just piece these guys out a little at a time. So if you're looking for a male exochromus, you go to buy it, it says sold out. Again, send me a message. We'll fix that really quick. And then down here we still have some book chromus rhodosai, rhodosai yellows. So there are a couple males right there's one you can see already. I think there's eight males confirmed for sure in this group. Females, I am unsure of. They're still a little, uh, still a little small for me to guarantee 100% uh, male or females. So, but if you're looking for some bucos, we can get you some males, or I can even get you a group to grow out. Just let me know. This is a new group that came in. I'm unsure of the ratio right now. These guys, they are settling in. These are some more Tania Chromus holotanias. Nice uh, Hepachromus from Blink Malawi. It's about 12 to 14 inches. Nice blue and yellow on them. More keep they keep the torpedo shape that they have now. The females keep the shape and just have the line through. So great fish. These I do need to add to the site. These are not listed. I know on there right now. Um, on there, I need to figure out what what the group is. Is it? Uh, hey, it's great to see you too. There, Fisherman Fever. Hope you have safe travels back. So I have to see what I'm going to do with these guys, if I can confirm, yeah, I know that's a male there, I know that's a male there, but I don't know females, so if I can confirm males and females, we will, uh, then I'll list them as, you know, ratios, or for sure list the males that I know that are uh, available. And then here are the uh, sunshine peacocks we have available, and the females, so there's three, four, six females available and a handful of males still that are available of these guys. Again, they're on sale $42.99 and $19.99. So nice, nice sunshine peacock male for $42.99. Don't miss out your opportunity to own one today for your all-male tank. So 
With that, just want to do a quick walkthrough, show you guys what we still have available. This is our nice uh, breeding group with Chinango Solosi. Used to be Pseudotrophia Solosi. She's she's holding there. We're hoping to get these guys to really take off again. They were really, really going good when I had them upstairs and they got behind my background so I couldn't uh, really pull the fry very well. So I ended up moving them down here and they're still yet to really, really take off. I do have six fry sitting, sitting in the 15, but uh, really would love a bunch more. So, but the fact that she's holding is a really good sign. We'll strip her this week, get those fry and hopefully we can get a couple more uh, to spawn here so and then of course don't forget food we do have our own line of fish foods yes the shelf looks bare we were just at an event however I do have everything in stock so if you need some fish food let me know and uh, we'll get it shipped out tomorrow or the next day with the other orders that we're gonna be sending out tomorrow from over the, the weekend here so and, and like I always I always say make sure to check our event page where we're going to be this Friday, we will be speaking uh, for you that come to the OCA extravaganza meetings this Friday. Uh, we will be speaking down there and we're going to talk about business or hobby. So a lot of it's going to go over what what things you need to consider. You know, if you're if you're doing your fish as a, as a hobby right now and you wanted to turn it into a business, you know, things that... Uh, you need to consider in doing that life lessons that I learned, some, uh, some just some things to consider, kind of what reasons why I turned my my hobby into a business. You know, putting up cichlids LLC instead of you know just doing it as a normal hobby. So I'll go through that. So I'll be down there talking Friday. We come back Saturday, Tuesday morning. Um, you guys follow me, you'll see a lot of content's going to come out starting next Tuesday, a week from this Tuesday. We will be down in Florida. We're going to go down to some uh, some wholesalers and visit some farms down there in Homestead is the plan. And then we're also speaking down there as well for the uh, Aquatic Club of Pasco County down there in Spring Hills, Florida. So look for a lot of stuff to come out, a lot of those snippets, maybe some underwater GoPro videos, you know, a lot of, a lot of different things to come here over the next week with uh, traveling down to Florida. We're super, super excited for that. So I can't wait. But one thing I don't want to forget, for you Tanganyikan lovers, I'm sorry, I keep forgetting you guys. We do have some uh, Lamprologus signatus. I can sex them. I can tell you male, female. Obviously there's a female without the stripes and a male somewhere in the right, somewhere right here with the stripes. So those I can sex for you. A little blurry, sorry, a little too close. There we go, better. Um, so those are available for those of you in the like black orange dorsals We do have some one and a half inch still black orange dorsals. These were a check import So they are not a line that's been floating around the US So if you want some little bit more diversity in your group We can help you out there Also have some red fin, Neil Amberlogus red fin cotta patatas available And some Neil Amberlogus multifishiatus. Lovely, you know if you like Shelly's, you like some Maltese. Oh, and I have some near Lamprologus tritocephalus available too. So I get small trets, they're an inch, inch and a half. But a great fish. If you want to grow out, make sure you have lids on your tanks because once you get a pair, they will push the other pair out of the tank. So you really got to watch for that when they get to be adults. But great Tanganyika. So I do have some Tanganyikans available. Still have a lot of Plecos. Um, Green phantoms available, really nice green phantoms. Still a couple blue phantoms in here that are available. Again, check out our site. Uh, this is the Placidochromus Electra Fort McGuire. So this is the black face Placidochromus uh, Electra. Different than the hobby strain uh, that we've seen around here, Electra. So those are on the site as well. If you want a different group to grow out. We also have these nice wild, wild caught Mylochromus choose males available. These guys are on the site as well. Every bit of five inch, nice males, nice color. And then I gotta add these guys, but if you want some Lithernop, uh, Tourney, Golden Harbor, or whatever it is, a lot of people are calling the uh, the Monkey Bay, I do Lithernops. I do have a group available. 
there is one of the males, of course, right there. There is a secondary male right there. Maybe a third male right there. So there are a couple males for sure in this group, but there's some females as well. So it looks like three males confirmed. So if you're looking for a male, uh, let them not. Attorney Harbor Island, let me know. I got a couple available from this group here. I just gotta get them added to the site. What I was to say for Shelly's is, you know, I keep coming back to, this is my favorite tank right now in the fish room. And, and in doing this, you know, you gotta have some tanks that you enjoy. It's gotta be fun. It can't seem like it's work. If it's work, you're not gonna wanna do it. So if you make it seem like it's fun, then you know, there's something you want to do, you want to take care of it, you want to, you know, enjoy it. So, this has got to be one of my fun tanks. This is a 160 gallon tank. Hey, great. They really appreciate that you love the food. I know hats we're working on getting a new reorder in on, us, on some hats. So, stay tuned for that. So, this is a 160 gallon, 6 foot by 2 foot tank. It's got some Neal Amperlogos Multificiatus. And some Cipacromus uh, speckled back, left to speckled back rainbows. There's one of the really cool speckled back uh, Cipacromus. So this is a great tank. Yes, it's 160 gallon tank. Yes, I know I have multi fishiatus little shellies in it. But I tell you what, with this with the jungle bell, everything's taken off. These guys are burying their shells, making their own little homes. There's some fry there. There, nice little, there's a little, little guy right there, uh, or girl, you know, guy or girl, don't know yet. Over here, right up on the shell there, can't, uh, can't get, can't zoom in on it, but we do have some more fry right above the shell back there. So there you go, see a little bit of view better there. Uh, swimming around and there's some fry back there in that little pocket too in the corner. So these guys are paired off and breeding. We got 10 more we're gonna throw in here to add with the group. And that should cap what we're gonna, you know, the final numbers for our uh, multi fishiatus group. And then we're just gonna watch these guys repopulate and enjoy, enjoy it. So we're still, are gonna, we are gonna do one more tank for fun. Um, it's gonna be a 160. We're thinking it's going to be over here where the uh, Exochromus antigenes are. Once these guys are gone, um, we're going to probably do something with this. I don't know yet. I don't know yet uh, what I want to do with it, but uh, we're going to do something neat for Lake Malawi um, for this. So we have a cool, fun Lake Malawi tank on one end, which is another 160 gallon tank. And we're gonna have a cool Lake Tanganyika tank on the other end. That's another 160 gallon tank. So just some different pieces for fun here in the fish room. So with that, I'm gonna end the stream. We've had a long weekend. We got a couple hours sleep Wednesday or Tuesday night. Got up early, had to leave uh, Wednesday, drive down to the Triple Crown there in Louisville. Louisville. Let me say that properly, sorry. I still wanna say Louisville. It's not Louisville, it's Louisville. So we were down in Louisville, and it took us about a five hour drive, not bad, not bad at all for us to get down there. But uh, you know, you're down there, you're up late, enjoy it. You know, you only see a lot of these fish keepers one t once, uh, once a year, and a lot of times it's at these uh, national conventions. So, you know, you're up late, you're talking fish, having a good time, learning from each other, sharing stories with each other, which is the best part of the hobby. Yes, the fish are great, but the personal connections you make in this hobby are a lot better and they they last a lifetime it doesn't matter it doesn't matter what you do you know you always got you always got your friends from the fish community you know to help you out if you need help uh so it's really great to uh to be able to see people so i you know we're up late at the conventions and helping them and enjoying our our time down there and then uh had to come to an end today and drive back from the uh, after the little bit of the auction and uh, you know go back today so finally got the U haul on pack so that I can go back tomorrow so I just want to do a quick live show you guys the fish room 
we did have some casualties you know that's that's part of leaving your fish room part of just keeping fish too anyway you know you lose fish is just part of it so we did uh lose some female bicolors out of this tank here for some reason i'm thinking maybe the heater got stuck but it not stuck itself because the heat's only 81 degrees there now the temperature wise the tank um which for cichlids is nothing crazy but i don't know what it was the last four days that i was here i'm assuming if the heater was stuck it would still be stuck but you know who knows sometimes with these heaters and that's another reason if you do a room heat your room then you don't have to worry about individual heaters but uh Right now, I, I have to worry about individual heaters for the moment. As you guys know, that follow me. So, with that, though, we're going to end the live stream. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Really, you know, really enjoy the support of the channel. All you guys that support me, everybody that comes up to me at these events and say, hey, I watch your YouTube channel. I love your videos. You know, I, I really appreciate that I do. Uh, it means a lot that you guys follow me and support me. And, and I do. I appreciate it. Just so you guys know. I know I don't say it enough, but... I want to make sure you guys know that I do, you know, do appreciate you out there. So with that, it's late. we got a work day tomorrow. i got to finish my talk. I've got to build my talk for Friday. Still have to work on that for the last couple, of, you know, rest for the uh, next couple days here. Got to get water changes done. Get stuff cut up maintenance-wise. So then we can leave again next Tuesday to, to go to Florida. So, again, stay tuned. Thanks, everybody, for watching. And have a great evening.